She danced at Walt Disney World for 10 years. She's been in the top five in the Fitness America pageant just three years ago, You're seventh right, really last come. year. She is always near the top, Mia. Todd, she always has one of my favorite routines in the competition. Look at that strong beginning to the routine. She did a split Shushanova to the ground. Her routine, just watch this routine. It's always amazing, strong, flexible, coordinated, beautiful stage presence. I love the way she holds herself. There are young competitors out there looking to get involved. She's not a bad role model. Oh, she's a great role model to watch. She always has the most amazing routines. And again, she was a world championship aerobic competitor. So, you know, that, that, that's amazing in itself that she's even doing this. With competitive aerobics in the 2000 Olympics, you may see Kelly representing the United States. Absolutely. Kelly, Kelly's always wonderful. And, you know, she's got the greatest attitude. She does it to have fun. Look at this beautiful two illusions. She's the only one who ever does the illusions in that way that are absolutely perfect. And her costumes. I can't say enough about her costumes. They always fit her beautifully. They stay in place. And that's one of the main things. When the judges are looking at that, they don't want to see that the bottoms, you know, slide up the rear end or anything. They want to see everything stays in place and everything stays inside the, inside the outfit itself. Kelly comes from a very competitive family. Her sister, a professional dancer. Her brother, a national racquetball champion. And Kelly, we've talked about her accolades. She always has a smile on her face. She always seems to be just having a blast out there. Oh, she is. And she loves being an athlete, and it really shows. Beautiful, strong press hold right there. Very difficult. Nice shoulder flip. Again, high energy routine from beginning to end, always. It seems like her energy never stops from beginning to end, and that's exactly what you want. Beautiful routine for Kelly, as always. Kelly consistently comes in in great shape with fantastic routines. And here is her score in the fitness round, 20.25. She's right now tied for fourth. Florida. Again, Kelly looks great. Todd, she really does, and she always looks great. Her poise on stage is amazing. And what she loves about these competitions is that they're getting more athletic with each year. Fitness pageants are starting to take on more of an athletic side to them. Um, you have to be a total athlete, especially with the obstacle course competitions coming into effect. And not only do you have to be able to jump over a wall, but you've got to be able to come up on stage and be graceful enough to do a little bit of balletic and gymnastic moves. And then at the same time, not have too many bruises to be able to put a bathing suit on and look halfway decent. And Kelly certainly does look halfway decent. She gets a score of 24.30 in the swimsuit round. She's not a bad score at all. Kelly Genelot is our next competitor. 32 years old, Palm Beach Garden, Florida, 5'6", 126 pounds. And Kelly is our leader coming out of the fitness routine competition. And you know what, Kelly looks great this year. She really has done a great job putting it all together. And uh, you know what, she's just like a lot of us who like to have our treat days every once in a while. I am a normal human being. I love a good cheeseburger and a plate of fries. Um, I do fluctuate five pounds, maybe, if that. Um, so I, I'm, I'm pretty lucky. I'm one of the lucky few that can go and have a cheeseburger, and it's okay every now and then. But when it's time for competition, it's time to get serious, and it's back to the boiled chicken and the, you know, potatoes. Well, she has been very serious in this competition this evening. As we mentioned, the leader after the fitness round, how did she do in the swimsuit? She did very well, a 20.70.